Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. I'm Jermamio, it is a pleasure to have you here. Alright, so... Last episode. Whoa, a lot of death, a lot of deaths. So, I think uh, we're probably going to have to look at leveling our character up a little bit. So that we're uh, at least competitive. So our next main mission's up here. And it's at a level 14 area. So I'm thinking maybe we need to do some encounters. Uh, I've also got a few safe houses over there to get to. Um, so what I'm thinking, maybe go to this safe house and do this encounter, and then we can get to this safe house. I think that's a good plan. So we might, might look at encounters slash safe houses today. And I'm mainly focusing on these... Um, situation board uh these medical ones i know there are a couple of tech ones and security ones around there's a lot more medical ones so let's look at getting our medical up um so first things first let's fast travel over here now um, entering a safe area now what we'll also probably want to look at is our loadout because um welcome to loadouts this menu offers the ability to save selections of weapons gear skills and talents into slots okay all right um how do i use it Well, it really doesn't allow me to change my my abilities. That's what I want to know how to do. I, I I'm just not sure how to change my talents. That's what's throwing me off here. Um, having said that, just looking at that, we've uh, definitely got some opportunity to upgrade what we're using. I'm gonna have to look at how I change my things. You'd, you'd surely it'd be in character, right? But it's just categories. Oh, I'm so confused. Alright, uh... Abilities, oh my god. There, right there, okay. So... At the moment... We got these two. What does this do? F heals all allies within a small radius. Uh... So I think instead of this one... See, yeah, see, this doesn't have anything about self-heal, whereas this one does. So let's put that into Q, I think. Um, talents. What have we got as our talent? Just that one, I think. Damage reduction. So maybe... Medkit, 7 seconds immunity. Use medkit during low health to increase damage resistance for 10 seconds. Press a hostile. Revive, we're not doing reviving. I think this one. Alright, that'll do for now. K. 
Okay, so that's how we get to it. We get to it from escape. That's good to know. Now let's have a look. Um, so the hunting M44. Uh, what do we know about this? So magazine 5 is to 15. So look, 925 damage to 3,200. So if I use this as a dedicated sniper, I think. So let's let's put that in the sniper slot. Now the DPS is lower, but this the single shot is much more damaging, which is what we want. Um, we're gonna strip this. Uh, get rid of all the weapon attachments on that, and then we're gonna dismantle it. Hey, what are you looking for? All right. Uh, now. It's a worn, but it's level 11, does a little bit more damage. Accuracy is less, but reload speed and stability. Oh, man, I'm, I'm inclined just to keep with that one, actually. Just for the accuracy. Alright, so we got our two weapons there. Um, this is, Do I not have any mods that I can put? I got... Yeah, surely, okay. Uh, we got a magazine that we can use. Heavy magazine spring. Rate of fire goes up. Pop that on. Beautiful. Under barrel. Critical hit damage. Lovely. Muzzle. Muzzle break. Lovely. No skin. I don't know where we get skins from. Um, C79 scope. 3.4. So we only really want like... A hollow sight would probably be good, right? So that's a 3.4 zoom, but yeah, we just want that thing. So that's that's good for that one. Let's have a look at modding this one. Okay, it's got a 12x scope. Uh, it's already linked, so we can't use that. That's all we can do there. Um, now, we want to switch to this. Just straight up more damage. Not as accurate, but I don't think I need to be with the pistol. Um, so let's dismantle that one. And let's have a look. Can we mod this? No, I've only got the, the muzzle break, which we've already got on something else. Okay, armor, I've only got one. Um, one, one, two. Okay, so we got a bit of an upgrade there. That's good. So we can get rid of this. Older glove. Beautiful. And we can clear up some of our mods. Performance mod. What is this going on? I don't know what that attaches to. So we're going to leave that one. Skill attributes, turret damage plus one. Um... So we got three of these plus we've got one on there so uh, let's go and dismantling three tools okay so that gets rid of those we still got a couple up our sleeve all right uh, load out and override so that's our current loadout I'm happy with that for now We stock a couple of grenades, which is good. Med kit's important. Okay, let's have a look at the map. So this is where we want to go first. Enemy level six. So this should be really easy. So we want to try and, if we can, get to level fourteen. Warning. Now we're exiting the safe area. Uh, <laughs> Mark wanted to run all the way back over there to go around this building. Sometimes this game is whack. 
I'm, I'm really keen to uh, test out this sniper, I tell you. We're going to be able to do some serious damage with this thing. JTF dispatch requesting backup. Multiple hostages reported at an electronics store on 11th. Priority 1, repeat priority 1. Warning. Hostile presence detected. Fabric. There they are. Okay. Don't know where that bullet went. Oh, missed that one. Nice. Let's uh, loot them before we head in there. What did this guy have for me? I'm green. Tactical vector. And a grenade. Lovely. You gotta remember to uh, reload the sniper. The sniper hits great. I love it. Love it already. But only five bullets, so definitely gonna want something with a bigger magazine, I think. Some electronics, lovely. Take the hostage key. Alright, we got some decent stuff out of that. Coming through, agent. Get, I want to get in there. Surely there's something for me to loot. There we go. Uh, you leave me speak. Go. Oh. MP7. We'll take that. Lock pick. I don't remember ever seeing a lock picking mechanism in this game before. Got some blue gloves, it was definitely worth it. Alright, so first of all, let's get those blue gloves on. Big jump up. Lovely. Critical hit chance and critical hit damage gone up. Dismantle that, we don't want that anymore. Um Yeah. Go we got the MP7. Tactical Vector, neither of them are particularly good, like, compared to this. So let's get rid of those. We're really looking for at least an upgrade on DPS for that main weapon. Okay, so I think... Um, we wanted to head up here. We want to get this safe house. I wonder if getting the safe house will um, unlock more encounters in that region. I thought I saw some red up there. Yeah, there you are. Imagine missing all those times. We don't talk about it. New encounter, I'm not concerned about it unless it forces me to do it. No, we're good. Hell's Kitchen. Ooh. This is, uh, this is our chance to meet Dead Agent, we've got hostiles at a Sarah warehouse on 40th requesting division support.
Jeez, that was turned in on me straight away. Kind of force me into this encounter, and if it forces me into it, I'm fine. Without you, we'd have been dead. Hopefully, that'll make them think twice about hitting the next JTF patrol they see. Morning, hostile forces approaching. Behind us. Both sides of us. Nicely done. Couldn't have done it without. Great work. You got my guys out of a tough spot. Yay. So yeah, don't mind doing those encounters if if it's forced, like forced upon me, but I'm not gonna go out of my way to do them unless I'm heading towards it specifically. He's a med kit? Ugh. It's a big give. And drop me some appearance skins. Tier one required? What does that even mean? What does world tier one mean? Okay. Well, if anyone is <laughs> watching the video and knows what that means and how I how I get a world tier one, let me know. Oh, look at that level! I didn't realize that level thirty. All right, so let's let's go for that safe house. Didn't realize that that safe house was a level thirty safe house. Some. Maybe that world tier one is something that comes up on later, just like automatically. Are you serious? Why? Fly acquisition. force me to do this one as well not sure 
That's alright, we'll keep going. Really close to this safe house. Yeah, I'm, uh, I haven't heard anything about World Tier. Which I can only assume it's something that comes later. This one's in my wheelhouse, though. So definitely be able to get by with this. This. Fast travel unlocked. Didn't unlock any more encounters. I'm gonna test something. What's this dude? Map updated, complete. Added a couple of encounters. Is that what I've been missing? I'm supposed to have done those. Alright, this is a 1415 area. I'll get that when I do that. So let's get this safe house, and then we're traveling back to the base of operations. Oh, actually, we can do this encounter along the way. Possibly that one if it forces us to do it. Jeez, we're not uh, not doing much in the way of leveling up. I've not even done a quarter of a level at this point. Oh, he wanted me to exit out a completely different way. I just assumed I had to come back to the the entrance. I don't think these encounters give as much as I was hoping. But as we did just find out, it gives the situation or to give us a little bit more information. So I'm going to have to make sure that when I go to safe houses, I look at that situation. It's definitely sort of holding off on doing those because I thought, oh, I didn't want to really do any side missions unless Agent, I have to. Agent, I'm getting word of a hostage situation in Hell's Kitchen on West 42nd. We could use your help. To put it mildly. What's his, what's his, he's a, like a, rocketeer guy? He's dead, that's what he is. Okay. Gotta get up there somehow.
Yeah, really not getting a lot of experience from this. We'll dispatch escorts to get these people home. Grateful you got there in time. All right. So where are we? Uh, we're there. So we're thinking this safe house. Why is this guy already half HP? Oh. oh my goodness. I pressed C instead of V. <sighs> Alright, let's, let's just get back to the base of operation. We'll worry about this safe house another time when we're closer. Let's see if there's a situation board in here and maybe talk to that JTF officer. Wonder what they do. Once we've done that, then we look at these couple of encounters here. You are now entering and a safe I've area. got a few supplies to spend as well. So that's, so while we're here, we do that. God, somebody did something about those guys. Have a good one. Yeah, let's see what we can get in the medical wing. The upgrades look great. If we live through this, I want you working in my lab. It's a shame you can't hover over them to see what your abil uh, abilities that you unlocked are. Excellent. Now we can provide proper care for all these kids and babies, not to mention the pregnant women. Alright, um... Take a look before it sells well, out. So you're Side a mission agent, huh? Great. Now, uh, don't dwell on all the death and carnage around you or the fact that so many have tried to do what Vendor, vendor, vendor! My god, so Restock. Nice to be afraid all the damn time. Was it this one? Yeah, so this has got a little bit of points that we can spend. Alright, um, so let's have a look. So they're the side missions that it's unlocked. You do you get a fair chunk for them? Completed that mission. Hmm. These are some things that I didn't know about before. But let's get these encounters, because I don't think these are gonna... They just give us credits and gear. These give us stuff to unlock our base. And that's what I'm really looking up, uh, looking towards at the moment. Gear, you know, if, if we get a gear, that's great. Uh, but you are now leaving the safe area. <laughs> it becomes obsolete so quickly.
Yeah, I'm a little concerned that uh, we've got almost no level today. Thank you. This is so great. I was hoping to be pushing level 13 by the end of this episode. So that way, at least I'm only one level down going into the next zone. Uh, thick snow is not great for uh, visibility. Calling all units near Penn Plaza. Reports of multiple civilian hostages at Rose on West 26. Proceed with caution. Seemed a little easy. Wait, that didn't pick it up? Oh my goodness. Yeah. More medical wing supplies. I think side missions are the way to go for XP. Thank you for that. Okay, so where are we? We're here. Uh, we're at 32 minutes, so maybe do this encounter. Actually, you know what? We're gonna have a short episode today. Let's end it off there, because um, we've had a few really long episodes back to back. <laughs> Means that next episode is also going to be a leveling episode, but I'm going to do those side missions next episode, which may just give us a little bit of story to work with. So thank you everyone that came out and watched the video. Appreciate you being here. Uh, socials will be in the description below. Um, please, if you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. If you're enjoying all of my videos, hit that subscribe button would uh, just be absolutely amazing to have some more people coming to the videos regularly. Uh, and until then, until tomorrow, everyone have a fantastic day.